good morning we are from svs embedded the project title name is called remote override of traffic signal in emergency uh, density based traffic like signaling system ambulance like that we can tell anything so in this project we are using an 889s52 microcontroller and we are using an lcd display and we used four lanes red orange green each side we are connected the ir uh, leds total 12 leds and we connected road 1 road 2 road 3 road 4 four roads we are using an ir sensors uh, high density and we we used we used one rf receiver that was connected to the port 3 Suppose any vehicle, it is uh, coming near to the junction, RF transmitter will send the data to the receiver called lane 1, lane 2, lane 3, lane 4. So the output I will show. So here I am using an 889S52 microcontroller. It is an 8 bit microcontroller. Total 40 pin IC, 4 ports. Each port consists of 8 8 pin total 32 input output bidirectional. So, this microcontroller works under 5 volts. So, that's way we designed a transformer based power source. So, I am giving the input AC to here 12 volts bridge rectifier, it converts AC to pulse rated DC. So, now I am using an AC capacitor 1000 micro farad by 25 volts electrolytic capacitor and here i am using one 7805 regulator to regulate 5 volts output it will show the led this is entire section is called power source and this is a reset circuit and this is the crystal oscillator 11.0592 megahertz it it generates the clock pulses to the internal cpu to run the program if the program is stuck we need to restart and this is an isp socket to dump the program onto the microcontroller via ISP so here port 0 it has to be connected to the 16 cross 2 LCD display character LCD display whatever the process is going on to the controller that should be displayed on the LCD and here we have a traffic signal called 4 lanes lane 1, lane 2, lane 3, lane 4, 4 lane each side I am connected the IR sensor called density which is the density is full that green light should be on and here I am using one RF receiver suppose any vehicle is coming nearer to the junction then then we are sending the lane 1 lane lane 1 lane 2 lane 3 lane 4 or lane 1 lane 2 lane 3 lane 4 we are sending the data to the transmitter the receiver will receive the signal and it will fetch to the microcontroller microcontroller will recognize that which lane it is coming it will show on the LCD display and after that according to the green light should be on so let us I am going to start the power source you can observe all is on after that it is showing remote override of traffic signal emergency now all said the signal is going on red orange green red orange green red orange green if if any side suppose i think this is one two three four suppose third lane means you can observe green color here the count will be 20 to 0 up up, up it will come come down to 0 then all the signal will be uh, goes on continuous process only uh, green will be on third one means the density will be high if it is goes on if it is com comes from first lane you can observe the green light should be on all should be reds okay so he, it gives the count suppose the ambulance is coming nearer to the nearer to the junction okay nearer to the junction suppose I am sending the signal of lane 1 you can observe it will give you the lane 1 first lane 
so I am giving the input signal that first lane should be on all three all three should be red only green now I am now I am opens it will no ambulance is coming that the signal is going on if I am giving the third one in the second one that second is on remaining three should be red the count will be decrement so this is an remote overhead of traffic density signaling system or traffic density ambulance or ambulance uh, uh, traffic uh, you can call anything uh, this is an uh, basically main the purpose is traffic area thanking you if there is any doubt let me know to SVS Embedded.